What's up guys, in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you how you might actually be able to quit the Marine Corps. So you might want to stick around. Alright, first things first, uh, the things I'm about to share with you, I do not recommend. So do not go out there saying Charlie Gray is telling me I need to be doing this to be able to get out of my contract. No, I'm not telling you to necessarily do any of these things. I'm just sharing with you ways that you know you can actually get out of your contract early. So the first way you can actually kind of get out early, kind of quit, is called a failure to adapt. Basically, that is saying that you are not conforming to the Marine Corps, you're not adapting to the Marine Corps life. Things that kind of show that you are not adapting, uh, that you are being a failure to adapt, is like getting in trouble a lot, going UA. So if you get multiple NJPs, you'll be getting kicked out. Going UA a lot, of course, you'll get kicked out. But there's one thing that's not going to necessarily be a kind of negative impact on yourself, and that's just like saying you're not mentally strong, right? You got things going on at home, and you just don't want to be a Marine anymore. And if you voice that enough to like your chaplain and stuff like that, and I'm going to tell you, your chaplain can get you out of a lot of things, right? But if you're going to your chaplain saying, you know what, I really don't want to be a Marine, I cannot mentally take this this is not good for my health and all that stuff then they will let you seek help and do all that stuff and they're going to try to, to get you the help first to be able to, to you know kind of motivate you again and try to be able and try to enable you to stay in the Marine Corps boy if you're just like no nah, I just can't do this absolutely quit uh, then they will send you home they will you know write up some paperwork for you and they will give you what's called an admin um, you know separation basically just it's not a honorable discharge it's not a like a, a dishonorable discharge anything like that it's just an admin separation they're basically saying you know what Marine Corps is just go ahead and letting you go and you just go on back into life and it just almost it's almost like you just weren't a marine All right so that's the first way you can do it you can just you know say you're just not mentally fit for it uh you can just be a failure to adapt the second way is fail drug test if you really want to get out that bad if you really are just hating it that bad then you know get out uh just go smoke some weed go do some cocaine do something and just pop on the next drug test and that's not going to necessarily be a dishonorable discharge uh, i know plenty of people that failed drug tests and just got an admin separation and they later on got a change at the va uh, a lot of people don't know that you can actually uh, try to get your you know discharge change at the va if it's not what you wanted so i know guys that got out like i said popped on the drug test and went back to the va and got their admin uh, discharge changed to an honorable discharge so they got some of their benefits back but yeah that is another way you can do it you can just fail a drug test and the last thing that you can do is fake a medical condition right um so i've seen people that are like fake like they had asthma for they brought up some past medical stuff or stuff like that that you know the marine corps didn't know about and things like that and i will tell you that part is dangerous right if you're faking a medical condition or you bring it up past medical things that you know you didn't share at meps that is going to maybe affect you negatively uh more than you even know so uh be careful with that um but that is a possibility of how you can get out medically also um i know a guy like claimed like he had insomnia right like he just didn't sleep on purpose he didn't sleep for days on end days on end and just looked like a walking zombie and these guys are like uh yeah maybe this is not the job for you and he was just saying like i can't sleep because of this reasons and this 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 and that and he just deprived himself of sleep and they actually gave him the opportunity to get an actual like medical discharge but he was like nah whatever and it just ended up being an admin discharge right um but yeah you can fake a medical injury so guys those are some of the ways that you can actually kind of get out of your contract kind of quit um ring core like i said i do not recommend i do not recommend whatsoever i recommend just toughing it out and just going through your four years and just after that if you want to be done then be done but those are some ways that you can kind of get out of your contract uh but guys if you like the video please give it a like leave me some comments down below have you heard of anybody that did any of those things that i stated uh, are you thinking about doing any of those things that i stated let me know down in the comments if you have not yet subscribed please subscribe also hit the notification bell so you do not miss my next video and as always guys thanks for watching